can cry and make it look real and sound real, but I don't see how an actor can just automatically make actual tears come out whenever. I mean, it's like... <laughs> Well, we all are girls. It's easier for girls to cry. How, how do you? Sometimes I have trouble not crying. Oh. oh. I told Trina to rehearse for our audition. I told her that our new principal is really tough, but she just didn't. Trina passed her audition. She did? Then you didn't. I. They're, they're kicking me out of Hollywood arts. I am so sorry, baby. Are you gonna cry? I don't know. Do you want to cry? I don't know. You're gonna cry. I remembers Mona Patterson or cares that she's gone. I'm sure she has lots of fans who care. No. On my way to school, I stopped at her store on Hollywood Boulevard and there weren't any flowers or anything. Just a weird man with a hat and some vomit on his pants. Yeah. Um, listen, I gave him a tidy wipe, but he ate it. <laughs> well, I'm sorry you're sad, but we have a science project due tomorrow and we still have a lot to do. No, I'm too sad to science. <laughs> Way to go, Urkel. Bob, what's happening? What's going on? Uh, nothing. <laughs> Chancellor, your... your octopus. Tell me, Bob! <laughs> She's dead, Baldy. <laughs> Bring her to me. To mine, feel the beat, and we're lost in time. I'm yours, and now, now you are mine forever, baby. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, come, there's a quiet room where you can sit with your friends. Hey, what you doing? Calling my mom to tell I want to go back to my old school. Why? Because I don't like having black coffee in my hair. Then I'll get you some cream and sugar. Everything will be chill. Hey, mom, I need to... Mm -mm, nope. Oh, give me back my mom! You're going to quit this school on your first day just because of one mean girl? It's not just her. It's just I don't fit in here with all this. I've seen what you can do on stage. You're special. You're fantastic. You belong at this school. Normal's boring. Incredible outfit. I look like an idiot. A pretty pink idiot. With a thing on her head. Thanks. Didn't expect to see you here. Well, everyone else was coming to cheer you on, so figured I would too. And you look way better in that than I would have. This isn't right. Yeah, it is a little tight around no. you. No! Not the stupid outfit, this. Me. I don't... This was supposed to be your night. This was your big chance, so... for me to go out there and... And... 
I can't do that to a friend. I'm not gonna sit here and listen to the two of you fight for the next two hours. Well, she's the one who two hours? I thought we were just driving to some dead actress's house and lighting a candle. We are. Her house is in San Diego. <laughs> San Diego? God, we gotta finish our science project before morning. No, I am not driving this rolling chiz box to San Diego and back. <laughs> Diego. All right. I feel like I should say a few words about it. Hurry. <laughs> Mona Patterson, I'm so sorry you died. I used to love watching you when I married my mom and I Go finish for her. <laughs> and Mona, your memory will live forever in your work on television, where you showed us all how funny and awkward it is when you marry your own mother. Amen. Let's go. Come on. Don't you think we should just wait one more minute? Who's out here? <laughs> Be gone, ghost of Mona Patterson. Go to the light. Cat, I'm almost sure she's not dead. <laughs> How's that coconut? Round, hairy. I'm sorry we took you to that play. Why sorry? I loved it. Well, just because it was about... You loved it? Mm-hmm. But you're all depressed. Does it show? Kinda. What's wrong? Well, see, I was dating this woman. And during the play, she sent me a text message. She dumped me and she's moving to Fresno. Oh, that's awesome! No, 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 I meant um, that we thought you were depressed because the play was about a high school teacher who's a sad, pathetic loser. And nothing. It's all right. I love being a teacher. Good. Well, I'm sorry your lady bailed on you. It is what it is. What it is. Jade? And now you're in my house. This kite is broken. Okay, and? I was just walking around and I saw this kite stuck in the bush and, and it's broken and someone needs to fix it. You want me to fix your kite? I'm sorry I brought it up. I want Beck back! But you broke up with Beck. I know! Just like when I was seven and I threw him my potato patch pal, but then I realized I wanted him back. But it was too late because my mother already gave it away to some greedy orphans. <laughs> Jade, if you want to get back together with Beck, then why don't you just tell him? I did, but he rejected me. Um. Not to be mean, but why are you coming to me for help? Because I don't want anyone who's cool to see me like this. Okay, maybe you should... Wait, are we friends? We're not even friends. Well, yeah, but if you help me, maybe I'll like you. So if I help you, I get a mean friend and a broken kite? Please, just please talk to Beck for me. <laughs> Danny. Hi. Where's Kat? Oh, she's still trying to get cheese out of her ear. <laughs> oh. All right, listen. I have no idea why I did that. Were you jealous? No. Because it doesn't make sense for you to be jealous. You broke up with me. I know. It makes zero sense. 
guess it's just a dumb girl thing. Like wearing a skirt over jeans? Yeah, what's up with that? I mean, are, are you maybe still into me? No, not at all. And I love Kat. She's like the sweetest thing ever. And I'm psyched you guys are going out. I guess it's, it's just... Side. No! Bobby, come on. Yeah, we'll get you some ice for your, uh, injuries. <laughs> no, just, just leave me here on the dirty ground where I belong. you feel? Sure. What do you know about ham boning? Too much. What I don't understand. Man, it's not me. Well, my boss was checking you out online. He saw you in that spaghetti costume singing about your favorite foods. And... That was a one-time thing. I swear, I take my music really seriously. I know that, but... Michael's got this thing about image. And you know, guys who dress up as pasta and sing songs about fruits and chicken fingers. Nuggets. Nuggets. That's not the image that he wants for the label. Sorry, kid. Give me your money. What? I ain't playing. Give me your money and your watch. Well, wouldn't you rather have this? Ow! Let me see, let me Are see. you okay? No, Tori hit me in the face for real. No, I didn't. Tell that to my bloody eye. Tori's not my friend. I only tolerate Robbie. No one likes Trina, and Kat's basically a pet. Are, Are you guys gonna let her say that nobody likes me? So, why don't you guys play cards with us? Look, I, I don't want to be your boyfriend if we're just going to fight all the time. So you want to break up? No, I, I didn't say that. I'm just saying... Are you guys might break up because I'm not dating anyone and I've always thought that Beck and I would make the perfect... <laughs> Next time it's a hammer! Come on, Beck, take me to get some food. I'm tired of fighting. Okay. I'm going to walk out that door and I'm going to count to ten. Don't forget three. Some people forget it. If I get to 10 and you're not out there, I'm going home. And we're over. One! I would never fight with you. Two! Three! Four! Five! Two!
Let's play some cards. What did Evan do when you told him your blonde hair was really a wig? What? I say. <laughs> what did Evan do when you told him your blonde hair was really a wig? That did not come up. You never told him you're wearing one of my wigs? I guess not. Or blue contacts? Also did not come up. So you spent like five hours with this guy and he still doesn't know what you really look like? No. Oh my God. What if he hates red-headed girls with brown eyes? <laughs> Don't worry, he won't. Are you crying? Yeah, I can't help it. I cry when I'm scared. <laughs> What is this? Underwear. They're so big. You know what? a sandwich and crying. I know. <laughs> Bye, sandwich. I wish I could go with you. Aww. Come here. Come on. Here, dry your eyes with this. <laughs> this paper towel smells like sink water. I know. Uh, what's your name? Pawnee. Oh, hi, Bonnie. I'm Tori. No, Pawnee. My name is Pawnee with a P. Pawnee! <laughs> oh, that's different. I know I have a bad name! <laughs> Let me out, Tat! This is kidnapping! More catnapping. <laughs> Open the door! I'm sorry, and I'm not just saying I'm sorry. I'm really, really, seriously sorry. You sprayed cheese on me and then kissed my boyfriend. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Why would you be mean to me? I don't know. Maybe I did still have a few tiny little feelings left for Danny. And maybe that's why I went a little crazy, seeing you two being all mushy together. Could have just talked to me about it. I know. What I did was terrible and awful and immature, and you have every right to be furious with me. I swear, Kat, if I were you, I'd just punch me right in the face. Now! <laughs> Kat! What? You just punched me in the face! You said to. I know, but that's just something people say. Ow! Does it hurt? A lot. I think my nose may be broken. Well, now I feel all bad. Don't. I deserved it. Feel better? I think so. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hi. You know what? It was wrong for me to come here. You're probably really busy, and I shouldn't. What's going on? <sighs> my mom. She. They might put her in jail. Come in, come in. <laughs> What's going on? What did your mom do? She, she's been stealing money at work. Stealing money? I don't even blame her. Her sister, my Aunt Susan, she's really sick and she needs an operation, but she's like broke. Oh my God. Listen, why don't you bring your Aunt Susan over here and then I'll put on some heavy shoes and then I'll jump up and down on her face. <laughs> you insensitive witch. You liar. Look, Sinjin told me the winning team on Brain Squeezer splits $10,000 and I want my share of that money, Vega. I mean it, I want my slice. 